We're gonna be trying these Pioneer Woman. Um, they're just different, uh, like appetizer type things. Uh, one of them is the toss toasted sauce the toasted sausage ravioli with marinara. This one is the zucchini chips with sweet and sour sauce, and this one is the goat cheese bites with marinara. These two, the sausage and the zucchini, are you preheat your oven to 450. The other one, the goat cheese bites, you preheat your oven to 425. We're actually going to do that in uh, probably a toaster oven. Um, I'll put it in the pan just so you can see them, and then we'll switch it over. We bought these at Meyer. They were five dollars and ninety nine cents a piece. They're all kind of different times, so let me just read each one of them. So the sausage ravioli with marinara. You are going to, and it's very tiny. Um, you're going to remove it, put it in a single layer, uh, place it on a baking sheet, and bake for five to six minutes. Flip them over, and then do another five to six minutes. So basically, for these, it's either going to be ten to twelve minutes total, but you're going to flip them halfway through. The zucchini. Let me show you. The goat cheese bites are basically the same thing, um, except they're on a lower the 425. They're going to be five minutes and thirty seconds to six minutes. Flip them over, then 5.30 to 6 minutes. So, very exact times. And then the zucchini chips are longer. It's going to be at 4.50, and it's going to be for um, 8.5 minutes to 9 minutes. Flip it over, then 8.5 minutes to 9 minutes. So, we'll just have to keep these in a little bit longer. So, let's see what these look like. Oh, there's a sauce too. Did it say how to do this sauce? I probably looked at it and just didn't pay attention. Um, put it in hot water to, for six to eight minutes. So we're just going to put the sauces in hot water. So there's the sauce packet. And basically, you almost, I mean, we're not going to do it, but you would need to bake all these at the same time because your sauce is in one big package. So you would have to do them all, you'd have to bake them all basically. So there's that one. This box is taped oddly, or glued oddly. Okay, same thing for this one. Here's the sauce packet for it. Wow, there's some big chips. And then the last one is the goat cheese bites. Here's the goat cheese bites. There's the sauce for them. And it's also a marinara. It's probably the same one. And like I said, I'm gonna put these on here just so you can see them, but then we'll move them over to a toaster oven. So that's what they look like. All right, so I'm gonna get these in the oven, set the appropriate timers, and I'll be back. Okay, we're gonna try the goat cheese bites first. Goat cheese with marinara. Creamy goat cheese covered in pretzel crumbs and served with a side of delicious marinara sauce. Four pieces is 420 calories, and then two tablespoons of the marinara is 20 calories. So which one is this? The the round um, ones? These are, uh, they look like uh, potato. Mm -hmm. You gonna try it without the marinara? Mm -hmm. And then with. That is a different flavor. I don't know that I've ever had goat cheese before. It doesn't taste like goat. No, but I don't. I don't care for it. Either. I don't really care for it either. Mm -hmm. It's. It's the texture is like almost like cream cheese, but it has a little bit of a funkiness to it. Yeah, I, I just like don't it. really care for. At all. I agree. Well, let's try the um, savory, the sausage ravioli. I had to get rid of that make, flavor. <laughs> make myself swallow that. It's better with the marinara because the marinara covers it, it up. Yeah. But now, if you like goat cheese, if you like that funky cheese, <laughs> then it's a funky. you will like that. But now, it is, it's, that's funky. Yeah, right. I don't like it either. Mm -mm. Well, let's eat the toasted ra sausage ravioli with marinara. This is ravioli filled with ooey, or gooey cheese and the sausage coated in seasoned breading and fried to a crispy perfection with a side of delicious marinara sauce. Not bad. Mm -mm. It's um. I it, can eat it. There's not as much flavor as I was hoping for. It's almost like a little pizza bite, like a pizza roll. Yeah. It um, honestly, I've had better. It's not bad at all. If you get it, I think 
It has a good sausage. It, I, I like it better with the marinara once again. It I just really marinara. like marinara sauce. But it's nice seasoned meat. Um, I wish it was a little crisper, even mm -hmm. though we did exactly what they yeah, said. They left we it baked in. it exactly like they said. Maybe even a little bit longer. Um, um, yeah, I wish it was a little crisper. It's just okay. It's yeah, not bad. The flavors are just okay. They're, like I said, it reminds me of a pizza instead of a. Um, Lastly, we have zucchini chips. These are uh, with sweet and sour sauce. Uh, this is thick cut zucchini coated in a crispy seasoned breading with a side of tasty sweet and sour sauce. Two pieces is 140 calories and two tablespoons of the sweet and sour is 35 calories. No. Try with sweet sour better. It's very tough. Because it is thick sliced, that's a problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very, very tough. It's not, it's almost like you're eating it raw. None of these have been really. Well, it being so thick makes it watery. Yeah, I agree. If it had been thinner, it wouldn't be as watery, but, 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 it being so thick, yeah. um, it would be hard for them to get all that juice out, even with all the baking. Yeah, um, I agree. They needed to be thinner. I'd rather have thin and crisp than thick and kind of chewy and dense. I, the I'd flavor kind thinner. of reminds me of like if I took a bite out of a raw pumpkin. Yeah, like, I could see that. Like yeah. when you're carving the, the pumpkin on Halloween and you get the smell of the pumpkin, that's what that tastes like. Yeah. That that tastes like that pumpkin smell. I don't care for that at all. See, when I, years ago, when I, the first restaurant I ever worked at, we did fried zucchini chips. Mm -hmm. We did ours really thin and they yeah. were, and they were and battered were and deep fried. Yeah. And they were crispy mm -hmm. and they had a really good flavor to them. Yeah. Um, these are too, they're way too thick. They and, went wrong by the thick thing. I they know. They did. Yeah. And she, I think they're trying to go thick. They are because it says thick know, cut. They're they, trying to make them thick. They like made you, the wrong decision. Yeah. I, honest <laughs> to goodness, truth be told, I wouldn't buy any of these. Bags. I would skip every one of them. There are too many other appetizer foods out there that are cheaper right? um farm ranch um they're that, cheaper that that are yeah that i would buy i would just pass on all of these this banquet yeah, yeah i i would yeah don't buy these just save save your money and don't buy i don't buy any of them so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching